But it's Saturday morning and you know what that means? Yard sale day and I just hit my first yard sale and I ended up getting my first pickup This is a video game that I got for the Xbox 360. It's called Dead Rising 2. Picked this up for five dollars Very good condition. This is sort of just like an all-around fun zombie killing game And if you didn't notice I'm out with my buddy here Roxy Bears I don't know if you can see her back there But uh, yeah, we're gonna go around today and see what we can pick up and just have some all-around good fun Supposedly there's some family yard sales going on up this way Here's a sign that says yard sale. I'm a little early. Everything starts at 8 o'clock, and right now it is 7.46. Uh, I think we'll stop here and see what's going on. Well, I just talked to one heck of a nice lady. Unfortunately, nothing good for sale. That one was just back in that garage right there. She said they've been running this since Thursday, so most of the stuff's been pretty much sold that was going to sell, and now it's just kind of like the leftovers. Looks like we got a little something over here, Roxy Bears. Yard sale and garage. Let's check that out. Man, again, it's same situation there. Nicest people in the world. They had a chocolate lab before, so she was loving Roxy. But again, nothing for sale. She said yesterday they pretty much sold out, sold about $300 worth of stuff. So I think I'm a day late and a dollar short for all these yard sales. Again, we got another one going on over here, though. So I will check that one out and we'll see what I can get. Hey, I'm going to leave you here for right now. Okay, I'll be right back. While I didn't find anything at that yard sale, the guy gave me a tip that if I'm looking for PlayStation 2 games, this place right over here is the place to look. Well, I took a look at those PlayStation games, and it wasn't really anything that I was looking for. I already have mobile PlayStation 2s and tons of games, but I just like to look around and see what people have. You never know when you might find something special. Is my poopsie still in here? Oh, there she is. There's that good girl. Oh well, on to the next one. Yeah, that's the one that I just passed on right there at the PlayStation 2 games. Back around here is the one that I just started out at. So I think I'm pretty much out of luck here in these little community yard sales. I think there was like maybe four or five. But uh, I guess that's enough. We'll head into town and we'll see what we can find over there. Uh, I was wrong. Got a little bit of a yard sale right here. I'm gonna stop. And we'll see what disappointment awaits me here. Well, boy, was I wrong. I got something for a little guy that I know. This is the uh, Elmo Sesame Street Clap Your Hands book. And it's like one of those ones that you put your fingers through and you do that. This isn't for you. This is for your brother. Yeah, that's for your brother. Oh, I'm Elmo. You hold on. I'm going to find you a toy here. I haven't found any dog toys yet. But I'll get you one. <laughs> Anybody ever teach you to share? We are officially at the end of the yard sales for this community, but I just want to take a moment to enjoy this view right here. Look at that. That's an Amish farm over there. Just look at this. This will probably all be developed someday with houses and stuff, but for now, very enjoyable. Hey, get away from that book. Speaking of interesting, take a look at this house. Orange with pink garage doors. That's somebody that doesn't conform right there. I appreciate that. You know what the house kind of reminds me of is if you ever seen the movie Edward Scissorhands, all the people that live in the town that Edward goes into, they all have crazy houses and that kind of looked like a house from that movie. So if you, if you know what I'm talking about, you'll get it instantly. If not, it's lost. Well, I'm in town right now and there's no official yard sales that I saw listed anywhere. So I'm just gonna kind of roll through and see if I can scout any signs out. If not, I do know of one that's a couple miles away, and we'll drive out there and see if there's anything going on there. Well, so far I'm not having any luck at all, but I'm going to keep hope alive. Here's something. Citizen's Hose Craft Show Chicken Barbecue, Saturday 9 to 3. I might be coming back for that chicken. All right, we're officially leaving town, and I'm going to head out to the other yard sale that I know exists. I know of at least one that's in the next town over, so we'll check that out. Of course, Roxy's always keeping her eye out for yard sales. Nothing gets by her. Uh, it says sail. We're going out this way. And then it says sail here. Oh boy. I think we're going to be skipping this one. Yeah, I think so. Sometimes you just got to make the call, and uh, that one isn't one that I want to really waste my time with. And there it is again. 
Tell me if I missed anything. Take your word for it. That's his garage sale right there. We're going up here. There's a doggy. Be nice. Be nice. Be nice. Hey, that's not the way we act. Holy crap. Driving all the way up here. I haven't seen another sign for a garage sale. Yeah. We're pretty much at the end. Well, that sign was just a lie. It says garage sale, move sale, top of hill, large house with green roof. Hmm. So yeah, on that sign down there, this is the place that's supposed to be having this garage sale. Doesn't look like there's a garage sale to me. Oh, just randomly, I found one that's off the grid here. No advertising, no signs, no nothing. So I'll stop in here and see what they got. Looks like a lot of girls' toys and clothes. Yeah, that one is not even a stop. Dang it. That is a bummer. Since the missus let me borrow her car, I thought I'd be a nice guy and fill it up with some petrol for her. This thing's talking to me. And their parents are so proud. What the heck? Oh, it's a screen down here. That's pretty different. Here's what our gas costs, $249 for regular. Not too bad compared to where it used to be. That's not too bad. Look how just gorgeous you look in the sun. Oh my goodness. I'm in love with this chocolate lab. So beautiful. I got something sweet to show you. This is something that I really would like to get, but they're really expensive. See those things right over there? They are like three-wheeled motorcycles. I forget what they're called, but I was checking them out online and they are so awesome. They got one tire in the back and two in the front. Man, they're sweet, but they're like twenty to $30,000. Like that one's probably 20, that one's probably 30, and uh, that's a little out of my price range. Here's a little bit of a better look. And I remember what they're called. They're called Can-Am Spiders. How freaking sweet is that? One of these days, one of these days, well, it's 8.48 and this chicken thing starts at 9 o'clock, so let's just drive our way out there and see if anything's happening a little bit early. Well, there's the fire department, and then over here are the fire trucks, and I see a little plume of smoke coming up behind here. This must be the cookout operation here. Looks like it's just fire guys going on right now, I'm not quite ready. Yeah, I just went in and talked to the guy and he said about another 10 minutes on the barbecue chicken. So I said, you know what? I'm willing to wait. This is what I'm focused on. And I got a hungry chocolate lab out here who loves herself some chicken and she's going to want some of that. I got it, Bear. I got it. Let's take a gander at this here and see what it looks like. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Well, the bad news is we gotta wait until we get home to eat this because I don't have any utensils or anything in here and it gets a little messy, but you're definitely gonna get hooked up. So let's head home. Here's the way I see it. You can get striked out at some yard sales on things, but if you can finish your morning off with some barbecue chicken, I think that's a win. Look what I got here. Check this out. Oh yeah, times two. No, this is from Drew. Hey, you better knock it off or you won't get your gift. Here's what else I got. I got a video game for $5, and this was $0.25 cents for a little bit. Hey, what are you doing? I'm going to catch you doing it. I see you. I see you doing it. Oh, you're real funny. I'm sure Clark used book. This is the Elmo Clap Your Hands book. 25 cents. And you open it up, and there's Elmo inside there. And it says, if you're happy and you know it, then your face will really show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. So clap, 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 clap. What? No. Oh. See? That's Elmo. I think he wants... Yeah, Elmo's in there. You open the book, and you read the pages. Yeah. 
Which Elmo? I'm going to... Yeah. Hi, I'm going to get you. He's saying like hi, D, yeah. like he says to Roxy. Hi, D. Hi, D. Oh, Elmo. Hi. Hi, D. Hi, <laughs> Roxy really wanted this toy. I figured that you would like it too. See, and then we can read the book later. Hi, Hi, So is your book. You can read that. Oh, rocks. I'm so sorry. We tried finding something for rocks that was a stuffed animal, but I didn't have any luck. So I told her I'd give her some chicken. And uh, back to the vacuum cleaner. So that's the only real toy you need to buy. See, we put Clark to work around here. Here we are, moment of truth. Oh, I have another fan here too, and this one. So yeah, Clark is um, going to town on these beans right now. You want a little piece of chicken? Here, one piece of that. Try it. Try some chicken. You can't, can you get it? Oh my goodness. Okay. I guess that piece is for you, Rex. <laughs> Whoa, this is not gonna be good. <laughs> Let me see your face. Yeah, you got into the beans a little bit. Chicken. Here, Roxy. Ooh. You start ripping the ends. You and those beans. You are just loving those beans, aren't you? How about how about I feed them to you? Or or not? Here, here. Isn't that? Hmm. You want the beans, you don't like the chicken, huh? Well, I know somebody that does. Here. Oh, hold on. Let me get a napkin. Don't put your hands in the beans while I'm gone. There we go. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to teach the baby. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All over yourself. We're gonna have to do a wardrobe change now, huh? I'll get you some beans. Here, this is how we eat them, right here. See? Mmm. How are they? They taste like baby fingers. Your brother's a mess. Here's some chicken for you, babe. Here's something for you to try. You want some coleslaw? Oh, no. Oh, no. You don't like coleslaw. Try it. I'm gonna clean you up. Messy, 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 messy. Let me see those hands. Yeah, you're the messiest boy. Woo! You're the messiest boy. Your pants, too. Oh my goodness, your pants. You got beans all over them. Beans on the pants. I'm cleaning them up right now. You made a big mess. And our table has coleslaw all over it. There, good as new. And for being my co-pilot today. There you go, Bear. You're a good girl.